All right, move on over and sink and Backstreet Boys. There is a new boy band on the scene, and that was just a little taste of their newest single, How Beautiful. On the Outside joins us now. Welcome, guys. Thanks so much for joining us. Hey, what's up? going on? Oh, I love that everyone talks at the same time. This is fun. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys, you, you really emerged as, as the way that only the most 2021 way could through TikTok. So uh, tell us how you guys met, how you got started, and your found newfound TikTok fame. Yeah, for sure. I mean, it all starts back when uh, our current ma manager, Amy Netto, you know, reached out to us over email and we kind of like, it was like a link off of one another mm -hmm. because I was living with him and I was like, dude, I'm a part of this boy band. It's awesome. Join it. So he joined. And yeah. then, <laughs> and then uh, next person we thought it was Andrew and he was on the show boy band with us. Mm -hmm. And then from there we, we found Dawson uh, uh, no. on the internet. Yeah, we found him on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And then, my best friend and so he became the last member so we all knew each other but we didn't know him but yeah. he <laughs> <figured it. laughs> so you guys were all friends well most of you guys were friends okay so how does this work do just talented people hang out with other talented people i mean i just don't understand how it's like oh yeah my best friend can sing and he can also be famous no big deal how does this work that was kind of how it was with sam yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Like, oh, this is my best yeah. friend. I was like, can yeah. he sing? Like, yeah, you can sing. I was like, all right. Like, this is great. You are, you are who you surround yourself with. Yeah. Right? Since we're just, we're, we're cool. in love with music and songwriting stuff, you know, those people just attract these. Yeah, ones, mutual so. thing. Yeah. That's so amazing. I love it so much. Okay, we just heard a little bit of your song, How Beautiful. You just released that. Congratulations, by the way. And it's not just beautiful because of the sentiment. It's actually doing good for the world. Tell us about that. Thank you. Sam, you want to talk to me? Yeah, um, since the beginning, that's been our main focus is to try to spread some positivity. And this song, How Beautiful, it started with that. It's written to the people who are struggling with their self-image and everything like that. And uh, it starts with our outsiders, our fans. We love them. And we just want to make some positivity. And it's mm -hmm. hopefully doing that. And we see that it's doing that. And we're really proud of it. Yeah. yeah. Well, and you already have millions of fans on TikTok. And you're talking about spreading positivity. And platforms, social media platforms especially, could really use that right now. How are you using uh, your platform as you guys are not only a boy band, but you're also influencers. So tell me how you're, how you're creating a discussion about beauty. I think, well, first it starts with the music. I mean, obviously the song, How Beautiful, the meaning in that, you know what I mean? The meaning behind it is all about positivity. It's just, do you even know just how beautiful you are? I think that's a message that needs to be spread, especially through social media, mm -hmm. you know, all these filters going on and everything like that. And comparing uh, yourselves to uh, these perfect people, mm -hmm. you right. know, just wanting, I don't know, that, that standard of social media mm -hmm. of comparison and um, wanting to be perfect or wanting to be like them, it, it sucks that we're trying to let people embrace their true beauty, you know, um, and express that their insecurities might be beautiful differences. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. you know, it's just all about the messaging, like Bloom yeah. said, about the music, and we're here to talk our booties off about it. But <laughs> Yeah. I have to ask, unfortunately we're out of time, but you know, we here in Vegas, we love our boy bands. Backstreet Boys have had a residency here. We were supposed to have the Joe Bros before the pandemic. Is that something you guys would hope for in the future? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Residency in Vegas is actually one of our goals that we've always wanted yeah. to achieve. Yeah. So. Yes. Okay. Speak it into existence and we'll all be going to the on the outside Vegas residency.